What's up, everybody? Today we're talking about Trader Joe's jalapeno hot sauce. Trader Joe's jalapeno hot sauce. Yeah, um, I know it sounds crazy, but we don't have Trader Joe's where we live, so this will be my first time ever trying any Trader Joe's hot sauce. How about you? Yeah, I mean, I think I've only been in a Trader Joe's once in my life, so... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm sure lots of people are like, oh, how have you guys never had this before? But, first time for everything. Yeah, um, yeah Trader Joe's, obviously, they make that stuff out in California, or it's based out of California. Um, but this one should be, uh, it's one of the simplest ingredients lists we've ever seen. It's red ripened jalapeno peppers, distilled vinegar, salt. So that means it could be, could be good. Yeah. Yeah. Like to compare it to, let's say crystal, which is, I think is one of both of our favorite normal yeah, you know, vinegar based hot sauces and all Southern that is just cayenne and vinegar. Yeah. And it's amazing. So, yeah, definitely. Maybe, maybe it'll be like that. Um, yeah, I don't know. Let's just, let's just go for it. I don't yeah. know. Trader Joe's, let's see what you got. But if we have to diss you, I'm okay with that too. That would probably be best for the video. I mean, people love the shit out of Trader Joe's. So. Yeah, yeah. Just lie and say we don't like it. <laughs> I like the color though. Red jalapenos are cool. You don't see that around very often. Oh, that comes out faster than I thought. And I don't know how much to do, so I'm just gonna wing it here and see. Oh, all right, Trader Joe's. All right. Very vinegar for it. That is a lot of vinegar. Initially, too much vinegar, but then the vinegar kind of dies down, and it has some okay. F I like the after flavor than the original flavor. Yeah, I don't dislike it, but you know, when there's that much vinegar, it's like that's all you can think about at first. Yeah, definitely. Um, it is not nearly as hot as I thought. Like, I'm gonna go back in for like a real spoonful. Because I'm not shy anymore about this one, but I was not sure what to expect. All right, let's give this another go. Mmm, so much vinegar right off the bat. It's almost like just for a half second, it just gives you a sour face. Yeah. <laughs> um. Like I said, I do like it. It's just the first second, it's like, why did I put this in my mouth? And then it gets better. Um, and I like the after, like, it's, it's weird that there's not pepper in there because I would have, like, pep, like, black pepper. Yeah. Because that's kind of the after flavor I get on that. There's not much of a burn, maybe a tiny bit in the very back of the throat. You feel a little creeping a little, but I think if they just dialed back the vinegar a little bit, this would be a really good sauce. I would agree with that. It's hard to get past that though. Like even a, <sighs> even a little bit after, like yeah, a lot of vinegar, and I I love vinegar, but that's a lot. Yep, very very vinegar for it. Um, yeah, I, I think, see that being really good in like Bloody Marys or something though. Yeah, I know? think. I don't think I would probably put this on a wing, but I could see if you put this with something else. Um, that needs vinegar. Yeah. Yeah. Or even like if you wanted to put a little bit of that on a burrito or something like that and, you know, have some tortilla and some rice and whatnot kind of soak up, kind of counter that vinegar flavor. I could see it adding some nice, nice flavor into sure. meat. But uh, yeah, a spoonful of vinegar. Whew. Yeah, it's quite quite vinegary, quite salty too. <laughs> yeah, this, <laughs> yeah. Well, um, yeah. 
What I don't know. We, we have another one uh, from Trader Grittos, their habanero one. So uh, look forward to that review coming out. We'll see uh, if this is a, a theme across their sauces or just they kind of missed the mark a little on this one. Yeah, I mean, you know, I think it's only natural too. We got to have a bad review every once in a while at least. So, yeah, you know, just because of the over vinegar usage, I'm giving this one a thumbs down. Yeah, the last sauce that we didn't like, um, this one's not as vinegary as that one. So True. it has that going for it. True. <laughs> yeah, so. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, I don't know. We'll see, Trader Joe's. Uh, you can do better. You heard it here first, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully we're the first people to review your sauce on YouTube. But... Yeah, we'll see what the habanero brings. You got anything else to add on this one? Not other than like Trader Joe's. If you want to send us some swag or something, we would take it. Yeah, uh, Scandi. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Send us a, your best hot sauce and a bunch of Scandinavian swimmers because those things are delicious. What is that? It's it's like multi flavored uh, Swedish fish. They've got yeah Ooh. yeah they're good. Is that the kind of cool shit you can find at Trader Joe's? That's 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 the only thing I ever request from anybody at Trader Joe's. But, okay. Yeah. So, uh, guys, thanks for checking this one out. Um, or if you guys are Trader Joe uh, diehards, let us know what their best sauce is down in the comments because this can't be it. But thanks for checking this one out. Uh, we'll catch you guys on the next one. Yeah. Till next time, keep up the heat.